Hi, Dr. Dan Purser here. Have you had problems with being tired and fatigued all your life? And no doctor's ever really been able to pinpoint the exact root cause of that. Have you had problems with depression and you've been put on SSRIs and they really freaked you out? The SSRIs did not help like Prozac or Effexor or Zoloft or any of those. They made you worse actually. And you couldn't figure out why and your doctor just scratched their head. Have, are, are you a woman and been put on birth control pills and they spun you out of control? They made you feel horrible and depressed and, and even angry and achy. There's a problem you may have that's gone pretty misdiagnosed in this country and really all over the world. It's kind of coming more to the forefront as the years have come by, especially the last two or three years. It's called MTHFR. It's really a methyl tetrahydrofolate reductase enzyme deficiency at a cellular level. It's a not really a gene mutation, but a transcription error that's occurred in, in your ancestry generations back and has been passed down. You may see this in your family. Your mom and dad may have acted a lot like you, and so you've just accepted it as normal. MTHFR is not normal. 85% of the U.S. population carries the SNPs, the single nucleotide proteases for MTHFR. 10 to 15% of the U.S. population has more than one of the SNPs, so they have two. That gives them the, effectively the illness. And so there are key vitamins, MTHFR vitamins and MTHFR supplements that you can take that will go around the mutation that have been designed to go around the enzyme issue and help you feel markedly better. I have a new book coming out called The 85% Solution, where I delve into MTHFR mutations, MTHFR gene mutations, and, and MTHFR vitamins, and MTHFR supplements, and MTHFR protocols, and methylation issues, and help you define them, help you figure it out if that's what's going on in your life. There's been a lot of really good books written on the subject, but I think my book is the most thorough. It's got the protocols. It's got how you diagnose it quickly and appropriately and effectively, how you look at vitamins at an intracellular level. So if you're wondering about if you have MTHFR, if you're wondering if you have a methylation problem or a B12 problem or a folate deficiency problem at a cellular level, and it could be genetic, check out my book, The 85% Solution on Amazon, on iBooks, and on Nook and Scribd. Thank you.